In this video, I'm going to talk about how to auto center the images in Obsidian. For example, I centered this image manually in the previous video, but now in this video, I want to do something so that I can auto center all of these images in Obsidian. So let's do that. So the first step is going to the projects folder, going to the vaults folder. And maybe you say, oh, I don't know what is my projects folder, where my project is located on my computer. There's no problem. For example, if I hover over here in this name, which is the name of my project, as you can see, this is the path of my project folder. By the way, if you can't see this panel, you need to click on this so that it shows up for example if you click on this again you can see it is not going to show those uh things i mean that panel so you need to click on this in order to expand this panel so if i right click on it it says show in system explorer so i click on it so this is my projects folder as you can see its name is youtube the same name as here so it is the name of my project the name of my vault so i open it and after that you can see we have a folder named obsidian dot obsidian so i open it and as you can see i have a folder named snippets but if you don't have any folder named snippets you need to create a folder and name it snippets but remember that you should pay attention to your spelling so type that uh, exactly like this snippets and all of those things must be lowercase so anyway uh, I open this folder. Now I need to create a file. But before that, we need to go to this view tab and make sure that we have checked this one, file name extensions. For example, as you can see, the extension of this file is .css. If you uncheck this one, you can't see those extensions, but we do want to see those extensions. So you should check this one. And after doing so, you should uh, right click and new and we want to create a text document so for example I can name it Sajjad which is my first name the reason I put my name in the beginning of uh, the name of the f of this file is that I want to recognize that oh this is something that I myself have created that's why I put my first name in the beginning of the name of this file and after that I want to say okay I want this uh, code is for auto centering the images and then i need to change this extension from txt to css and then i press enter and it says oh are you sure that you want to change the type of this file i mean from txt to css yes i'm sure so i want to change it and i press yes so this is a css file that I have created. So now I need to open uh, this file using, for example, Notepad or any other editor that you have. So I right click on it and I want to open it with Notepad and I paste a piece of code, which I'll put this piece of code in the comments section and I will pin this piece of code in the comments section. And after that, I need to go to File and Save. So that's it, we have created a file and also uh, we have modified this file and we have put some stuff in it. So now let's minimize this window because we don't need it anymore. And then we need to go to settings. So I click on this, then you need to go to the appearance section. So I click on it and then I should just scroll down and scroll down and scroll down. And as you can see here, we have CSS snippets and you need to enable this snippet which we have created so you need to enable this and after that i close this window and there you go as you can see we have auto centered all of these images and also if you go to the reading mode you can see it works there as well so we have auto centered these images both in the editing mode and also the reading mode this was one of the videos of a step-by-step -step tutorial playlist of obsidian you can find the link to that playlist in the description below and also we have other playlists for other topics which you can find them on the channel page